Tuesday, I was in a watch party. We were watching the first episode of Ahsoka. This episode is only 50 some odd minutes long, and yet it felt like an eternity. The acting is more wooden than the 2x4 I ran into last week. The pacing is an absolute nightmare, dragging on scenes for far longer than they need to be. Dialogue goes on for way too long, and has all the charisma of a wet napkin, at worst. At best, it has the charisma of a computer trying to mimic human speech. The whole episode, despite costing more than a house, just screams amateur hour. All scenes outside are washed out as usual. The lightsaber fight at the end is incredibly stiff and wooden, giving the geriatric lightsaber fight in A New Hope a run for its money and how bad it can be. Remember when Qui-Gon died in Episode 1? He got stabbed right through the middle by Darth Maul, who would later get cut in half by Obi-Wan Kenobi, but somehow Darth Maul survived on his pure rage. TCW, much like Ahsoka, and every other Disney Star Wars show, is led by Dave Filoni, who is basically the reason why the old expanded universe fell apart, and basically the reason why lightsabers basically have the effectiveness they do at this point in time, such as being less effective than a wet pool noodle. Hell, I've seen wet pool noodles with more penetrating power than a felony lightsaber. During the watch party, some of us were quite literally listing off things we would rather be doing than watching this shit. We were so bored that we quite literally ripped the entire episode to shreds and still knew we had plenty of material to rip apart for this one episode. I fear when we have to do the entire thing, because honestly, I don't think I could survive it. Dave Filoni's fans will obviously eat this shit up and proclaim him the savior of Star Wars who will eventually retcon the sequel trilogy and set things the way they should be. Bull fucking shit, the man was heavily involved with the sequel trilogy and agreed with a lot of their ideas. The man even shadowed Ryan Johnson for God's sake. And let us not forget, the new continuity is basically falling apart, mainly thanks to Filoni constantly having the need to retcon basically anything he didn't write. It's only a matter of time before they have to wipe the slate clean again, because it is such a mess behind the scenes. The only good thing about the show is that I actually made friends during the watch party, and... Well, we did have a little fun roasting it, but that's just about it, really. The whole thing is a boring mess, and I really wouldn't recommend it. Honestly, I wanted my soul to leave my body so I wouldn't have to watch this shit. Setting up now, I would rather spend six hours at the dentist than watch this shit. Literally anything except bodily harm, death, and a few other things is better than this show. I cannot recommend it to anyone under any circumstance. Honestly, it is the most boring thing I've seen in a long time. I would rather watch all of the filler in Naruto and One Piece. Back to back. Hell, if you want a light-hearted adventure that doesn't take itself overly seriously, but is actually a really good time, watch the original Dirty Pair series. It's classic girls with guns, and honestly, it's a really good time. I highly recommend. Peace out, everyone.